Hey guys, welcome to another Gauging Gadgets iPhone tutorial video. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to reset your iPhone to factory defaults. So doing this will factory reset your iPhone to exactly the way it was when you got it out of the box brand new or refurbished. Now this can be useful for a couple of reasons. Maybe you're selling your iPhone or giving it to someone and you wanna remove all your data, or maybe your iPhone is not working correctly and you wanna reset it just so that you have it back to the way it was when you first got it. And the steps in this tutorial can be performed on all current iPhones running iOS 14. Now there are a couple of requirements to actually perform the steps in this tutorial. First, you'll need the passcode to unlock your iPhone, and then you will need your password to your iCloud account, which is the account used to back up all the data on your iPhone to iCloud. Now before you actually factory reset your iPhone, I do recommend backing up all the data. And you can do that either through iTunes or you can use iCloud on your iPhone. It's very simple, just go into the settings. Then in the settings, select your name, then select iCloud. And then once you get to iCloud, scroll about halfway down until you see iCloud backup. And then under here, just select backup now. So make sure it runs that, it'll back up everything on your phone. Once you've backed up your iPhone so that all the data on it is saved and you don't have to worry about it being deleted, we're ready to actually perform a factory reset on our iPhone. To get started, the first thing we need to do is open the settings on our iPhone. So open the settings and then select your name at the very top of the settings. Once you're in here, scroll down until you see Find My. What we need to do is turn Find My Phone off. So select that. And then if you see Find My Phone, go ahead and select that and make sure that you have this turned off. You will need your iCloud account password for this, so go ahead and enter your password, and then just select Turn Off. So now we've turned off Find My Phone. Once we've turned off Find My Phone, simply go back to Apple ID right here. And from here, before we can actually perform a factory reset, we need to sign out of our iPhone. And that's very easy to do from the Apple ID page right here. Simply scroll down and under all of your devices, go to the bottom and select Sign Out. Confirm that you want to sign out of your phone. And then it will remove your iCloud data from your phone. Once it brings you back to the main page of the settings and it says sign into your iPhone, we're ready to actually perform a factory reset on our iPhone. And we do that in the settings by scrolling down until you see general, select general, and then go to the bottom of general until you see reset. Go ahead and select reset. Now in reset, all we need to do is select erase all content and settings, select that, Go ahead and enter the passcode you use to access your phone. And then at the bottom, it shows a quick warning that just says this is gonna erase all the media, data, and settings from your phone, and it cannot be undone. So if you're ready to do that, go ahead and select Erase iPhone. Then it will reboot the phone and factory reset it. After a couple minutes, your phone will reboot and show up to this screen, which is the same screen you saw when you first turned on your iPhone. So now you can sell it, or if you just wanna go ahead and start using it, you can go through the same setup process that you would with any other iPhone. All right, so that's how you perform a factory reset of your iPhone in iOS 14. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more iPhone tutorial videos, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up, and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gauging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.